Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jack and this is Sipping with Jack, which is a channel where I try all the type of drinks, non-alcoholic and alcoholic. And in today's video, we are going to be trying out my little favorite place ever, which is Big B's Coffee. And I'm going to be trying out the chocolate covered leprechaun drink. And as you guys know, my birthday was Monday. Today is Wednesday, like actual St. Patty's Day. And I'm going to make sure that this video goes up. But anyway, so... If you guys know, if you follow me on IG, my birthday was Monday, so I got a free drink. So you can see, I got it frozen and I got it large. So I think I got it 20 ounces and then I got the chocolate covered uh, leprechaun and I got it frozen. So if you guys don't know, majority of um, Big B drinks, you can get them hot, frozen, or iced. Today, I just thought, might as well let's go ahead try something free on their dime you know what i'm saying so i got this frozen which when you get it frozen you can't have any like substitutes or anything because it's you know going to be made frozen so i did take my dairy pill i am prepared but um you can also get this um iced or hot if you have that option and they do have another like saint patty's day drink i think it's called the lucky charm latte that one looked really really good um this one i got because it had mocha in it and then it had irish cream and i i love me some irish cream y'all the way i talk about cinnamon is literally the way i talk about irish cream i love irish cream back when i used to work in the office because now I just work from home but at my last job when I used to work in the office they would always have like the international delight Irish cream and like the coffee section I would always pump it in my tea or my coffee and I loved it so today we're gonna try this which as I said it has mocha and it has Irish cream in it the lucky charm has I believe Irish cream and marshmallow um, syrup which I don't know how they do that but we'll see we'll see but let's go ahead and get this started today it's actually like 60 degrees outside so that's why I got a I or frozen because I just felt that way but let's go ahead and try this out oh also has espresso in it I never said that but it has espresso in it because that's why it's a latte Ooh. It's really messy. Like everything is like leaking from the top. They like filled this up to the brim. Like it was here. Okay. So first things first. Because it's frozen, I don't feel like I can taste the things as well if it's iced or if it's hot. But dang it, y'all. This tastes like it does taste like a frozen latte. Like it tastes really good. It tastes like espresso. The only thing I'm going to say, I can't really taste this like the Irish cream, but I do taste the chocolate syrup and I taste the mocha, which I like. Don't get me wrong. I like it. It just, it's really coming off like a mocha, like period, just like a regular, like mocha frappuccino or something. Yeah, the Irish cream's not propping through that much, but as I said, it just could be because I got this frozen and of course there could be stronger flavors peeking through so that's why i'm gonna chop it up too but i'm super happy that i tried this frozen because i've never actually tried any of their drinks ever in a frozen version and i really like this i really like it because the only thing i could compare it to is maybe like a mocha frappuccino from like starbucks or something but i'm telling you you can taste the espresso in here a lot more and it just tastes more like a coffee based drink more than like i don't know starbucks if i can say that okay final thoughts my loves <coughs> whoa i didn't mean those to be my final final thoughts i literally just choked <laughs> a mess I feel like I'm such a high risk of like things going down the wrong pipe. 
Okay, now that I'm done choking to death and also advertising the macaroons, I'm gonna go ahead and rate this a four. Um, just because I feel like it, I've had it before, it's been done before. Can't really taste the Irish cream. I'm just not tasting it, but as I said, it could be, I taste the espresso, and I taste the mocha, and they could be dominating flavors. That's what I'm saying. So, they could be overpowering any of the Irish cream. <clears throat> wow, I'm like a high risk of choking. Like, I just realized I'm very high risk. But anyway, overall, I would rate it a four, just because I just can't really taste the Irish cream, and I feel like the Irish cream was the X factor. And it's not coming through, but I'm definitely going to see if I can try the Lucky Charm Latte. And I might actually do a poll on my IG channel, which <clears throat> put my IG right here. And I'll probably do a poll tomorrow on Thursday or Friday just to see if you guys want me to try the Lucky Charm Latte. If you guys are interested. But anyway, that's all for me. I like it, but... Because I said that the Irish cream would have been the X factor, but right now, because <clears throat> I can't taste it, it's pretty much average for me. It's like a mocha frappuccino. That's just basically what it is to me. It's not very special. But anyway, I'm glad I tried it. And I'm glad I got it for free. Thank you, Big B. But anyway, I hope you guys have a great day, a great afternoon, a great time wherever you are. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to this video. And don't forget to keep on sipping. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.